My mother has lived in Malakuta for the last 50 odd years, so we've been visiting here probably since I was about 20. The house that was here before was built by my mother and a partner in the early 70s, and it was this funky, hippie, mud brick house, but that got destroyed and everything in it in the bushfires in 2019. Every house up to this one and the one next door um, just got destroyed by the fire. There were quite a lot of modular houses um, coming into Malakuta. This one tended to look a bit different from most of the others and with the timber on all the north side walls, it really fitted into the bush. So there was a lot of positive commentary about it. You know, a small town like Malakuta, everyone talks, but people would come back and come around and look at the house and she was pretty pleased that there was this positive commentary about it. I was already sort of interested in houses and architecture. We built our own house, uh, energy efficient house 20 years ago. But with my mother not being well, with Malakuta being so far from anywhere, with so many houses being destroyed, we knew that it would be really hard to get a house designed and built from scratch using local builders or even interstate builders in a reasonable time frame. So we both thought that getting a modular house would be a good way to go. She really liked the fact that Ecolive had these energy efficient houses. One thing where Ecolive were fantastic and especially the guys who came here on the job, they knew that she wasn't well. They hurried the build up uh, and, and did little things like putting the ramp on so she could bring a scooter up. She got here and had a bit over six weeks here and she enjoyed it all, you know. She actually died a lot earlier than we expected. And it's funny to say this, but she was sort of content. She, you know, did end up living in her own house, um, which is what she wanted.